Sonic video. So yeah, though, of course, we need to get some new news right here. Like I said, another probably shorter video. Well, I'm not going to probably freak out about. Because my other Sonic videos, I haven't seen my last one. Actually, I'm curious. Do I have YouTube open? I do. Um, because I was actually going through my um, all my Sonic videos last few weeks. You guys have been killing it, though. Thank you so much for all the support and everything and love. Um, but yeah. Um, Alright. Nope. Don't want to look at that. More Spyro. We're trying to no low-key not spoilers. Um... Okay, not Spider-Verse spoilers. Because they keep trying to show off more clips for that movie. I'm like, no, don't do that. How's my last time video? I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just looking through it. If I can get to it. It is loading like molasses. Probably I'm recording and doing everything else. Okay, okay, yeah, because didn't, it didn't go live that long. Never mind. Because um, I know it's like not new news though, but it's like I was talking about Takashi Yazuka's like new interview that he went through. I'll have to break those down and talk about those as well. I think I really didn't do it well though. I used to just like new news videos. But we do got some like news, some like actually legit news right here. I think it's not going on character. It's the last few days he has been really relevant for the, um, not relevant, but I won't say relevant like that. But really, on the news with a lot of the new news that's been coming out, they'll shout out to them though, of course. Maybe as a team, maybe it's somebody by themselves. Thank you so much. But like I said, they have been doing that a lot more lately, though. So almost every day I've been getting at least uh, two or three new, new things of Sonic news, though, which I love. But yeah, of course, pretty much, yeah. Kind of Frontiers low-key. I won't say kind of Frontiers news, but, um... But, um... Not really, though. But like I said, it's just like a new, just news thing, pretty much. Um, him going over this. So like I said, I like to kind of, like, just... I mean, not relevant, but I, I didn't want to say relevant, though. I wanted to say, um, more recently, they've been on, on the news, news for Sonic and all characters. Oh, they've been on the news for like, the um, news for Sonic lately, though, like Sonic Prime. Even though it's like little bit tidbits of news every day, that's good though, because the interview video went over the um, the new the game news and stuff like that. Of course, I mean, it's technically all news though, so I think this thing, it is game news, a big thing though, because holy crap, they didn't mention this in that interview and um, what happened before and everything. Just all that just come together, and I'm so glad I did those videos though. They're not out of date or anything like that. Which, like I said, Sonic videos, like I got them like a date, a week later, you guys still will watch them though. You guys are insane. I love you for that, though. I know I say every video, but you guys are insane. But yeah, in a good way, though, of course. But yeah, though, of course. Uh, pretty much right here it says, um, the next time game might be, um, might, um, get a team of 300 people, like I said, but I not confirm. Pre Morimoto, Mor Mori, um, Kashimoto, I was like Kashimoto, has com compliment, um, com uh, can I speak today? Can I speak? Um, commented um, the amount of people who worked on Sonic Frontiers to credit um, feature the names of who um, associated with the development then um, even um, is it even yeah even unofficially because I know in this like little interview like little thing I went over right here for um was um yeah Kashimoto he basically said he's probably really don't think about retiring and stuff like that um and of course the um interview right here um <clears throat> for Izuka I mean, like there's like, a whole marketing team there's a um, whole development team like whole people who like can make just commercial for Sonic one like 40 or more people work at Sega how about with the game 40 I think like 400 almost 300 people who literally just work on the um like the develop like the development the marketing all is broken down to one in its own categories which kind of does make sense because you don't want everything all mixed up into one but like I said I, I went over that in those videos so if you want to go see my full thoughts I want to go over there because I want to spoil it for you guys just in case you're watching the videos out of order there's no order you should watch them in though so it doesn't matter but yeah, though, um, so go ahead and read over it, though, of course. Of course, I've only translated everything. They get a Google Translate. Staff credits are listed of those who have um, revolved, you know, a little bit, a little bit, I say a little. I would be happy if the next game could have be developed on that scale, on a scale, pretty much like basically the ones people who worked on Frontiers, pretty much that scaling over to the next game, if it can be um, realized, or rec I say recognized, I say realized, recognized, I always kind of get those two words mixed up. Um, I think the development credit that time will exceed over 300 people. So pretty much just not confirming, but pretty much he said he wishes. Not really confirmed, but he wishes that he wants like a whole pretty much 200 people to work on the game. Because I think it said like 400 people. He was like, let me find that image really quick. That'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, but yeah, I did um, go over here like, yeah, the new ideas for Frontiers and everything. Oh, no, it's not. Oh, 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 oh. But yeah, right here, pretty much, yeah, the branches. That just brings to the next uh, the videos. We like 400 people in the U.S. pretty much um, developed the game. 400 people pretty much, you know, the divisions are divided up like the Puyo Puyo, the crossover stuff, and um, et cetera, et cetera, pretty much. So, like I said, I don't want to repeat too much of my video and spoil the other ones, but 
Yeah, Frontiers had a lot of development, though. I think, it, I know we had the 2021 image, uh, slash, um, early, not image, but early, well, kind of, yeah, maybe, it's, yeah, kind of, early, like, because you know, it was leaked out first. Um, that's like Frontiers was getting announced, something like she was him running, um, like one of the very first preview trailers that we saw Frontiers. I'm in 2022, I believe. Oh, 2021. The ending of 2021 with the Game Awards. Which, like I said, we could get more stuff like during December, though, because I think the, the last DLC again is going to be pretty much near the end of the year. Which kind of does make sense, though. You know, we want to end off the year, right? Because next one, next update for Frontier definitely should be Sonic. It's going to be on Sonic's birthday, so we are going to, it's going to be confirmed on Sonic Central, which should be sometime in June. I think it's early June. I can't remember now, but it's going to be sometime in June. And the PlayStation um, Play event Dexy did go on yesterday because I did see the new Spider Man 2 footage. Yes, I did see it. Um, pretty much, um, yeah, pretty much, um, because we had no Sonic gameplay or anything like that, which I, everybody was thinking that. I was like, no, guys, you gotta do it during the Sonic Central stuff. It makes sense. Again, it's right here. Easy, perfect, though. But yeah, though, honestly, going back to the subject and everything, the next Sonic game might be having 300 people. That's good, though, because, I mean, Frontier did really well. I know, like, early Zuka, I think, or Mishima Kashimoto mentioned that they want, didn't want to remake the Frederick King with this, you know, system, and it can, and it, it does work, though, like, Sonic, they can fine-tune stuff, like, fine-tune some stuff like Sonic's jumping, his speed, maybe, you know, his speed was fine, jumping, you know, making, like, accelerating, the spin dash with the, um, the bit of people, again, spin dash is still in, like, Sonic Frontiers, like, the, it's still in the game, like, it's still being developed right now as we speak, but I could be able to update 3, or maybe update 2, because it was confirmed coming to Frontiers, they did find it in some of the game source files, which was leaked out, like, probably, like, a good month ago or two now. So I made a show on that because I've been just so busy. But yeah, though, um, I got some time to get off and actually uh, just off work and everything. Finally get some stuff done. But yeah, though, and the video will be uploaded today. I just kind of like keep it just the Sonic flow going though, because I know if I do like two or three more Sonic videos, people usually get burnt out. Like, eh, I don't feel like it. <laughs> Sorry about that. I had a little while. My nose is getting up. My nose is getting up my nerves. Let me try to do. Yeah, but I work a lot lately, so. But yeah, though, um. Yeah, like the next game from 300 people. I'm excited for that, though. Again, Frontiers did really, really well. Got a lot of good reviews. People say it was one of the best on games they played. Also, the modern era, in my opinion. I want to say probably it's number two, number three for me. Probably number two for me. I want to say. Because I did like colors, but I don't know. I think Frontiers just has the best control for me, honestly. It's like the controls I wanted in a Sonic game, period, honestly. Like, I've been wanting this in, like, a Sonic game forever now, with these controls. <clears throat> also, it's just that, um, in general, like, it, like, it's a good game. Like, overall, it's a really good game, though, so. It's just that, like, they made it so good. The combat, of course, like I could use some more work, like, you know, make the combos kind of more fluent. Like, make it kind of flow all through, not like, oh, hit this button, hit that button, or hit this button, hit that button, and, um, you know, you get this combo, you get that combo, you just get random, like, the auto combo, whatever, et cetera, et cetera, but, um. Yeah, though, like I said, um, again, they did get by two stuff like that, um, make the, you know, more animations, like I said, they did mention that in here as well, he, they, um, we should have saw, like, a lot of the fan stuff, like, oh yeah, um, saw some fans do some, like, homing attack, the animations, some of, like, idle animations and everything, but like I said, with 300 people, though, and, like, with Frontiers, like, with the developers, you know, like I said, next game right now could be under development, because right after Forces was done, they were like, yeah, we're gonna help on the next game, so, I, I don't know, in 2020, for five, 2026, I don't know, because yeah, that's on the game. Probably like next year or two, and um, because like I said, these games do take time, and then we could be like, oh yeah, in 2023, they had this footage from this game. Again, we don't know what's gonna be next, so it could be Frontiers 2, everybody been thinking that. I'll oh, actually would love that, though. Uh, another open world game, but right back to back, though, I mean, I guess not too sudden, though, because you know, Frontiers is fresh and new, while you have Frontiers 2, you get like, you know, some updated stuff like that here and there. Not like a Miles Morales game, but honestly, though, um, I like this though. I like this idea and everything. I'm really glad. <clears throat> That's surprise. Sorry about my noise. Just, just wheeze, man. Our thoughts not going through it today. But, um, but yeah, those pretty much everything I want to kind of cover and go over, go over today. So, but yeah, thank you for um, everybody showing up though. Shouting out everybody and everything. Yeah, I just want to make this video kind of short though. Nothing like crazy, crazy in here though. But I mean, it is crazy news because 300 people working on the next game, and if we get the good development like we did from Frontiers. No, we had early gameplay, we had early stuff, we had early leaks, you know, it took like two or three months, you know, in April they dropped everything of last year, so, yeah, that stuff is your old now, that's crazy on my channel, 
But yeah, like all the footage and everything that we had, I mean, hey, it could, it could work. I think it could work and stuff like that, of course. Good development, good, like, you know, your skill and ship, shipment, like, and everything, development, marketing. You know, I feel like it's kind of all the last second, you know, with the um, development, because holy crap, the game, like, the world premiere with the, um, the, um, for the game awards was, the like, gameplay was not like, yeah, this is not getting me excited. Just do like the Switch did, you know, to bring out new gameplay. Well, actually, no, Nintendo actually did that, though. People complain, like, oh, Sonic Frontier doesn't look good on the Switch, hyper, blah, 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 blah. I don't got it on Switch, I got it on PS4. Even if it was PS5, it would have been 60 frames per second. We had the last time I'm excited though for this. See you guys there though, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, guys. Welcome to the NMF. Stay safe, watch Shams, Gumbas, all of you going up on our match. Don't talk people really to get back there. If I can't go outside, take you guys in the cup of them. Shout out to the Discord social if you're aware, guys. All awesome. So, we're going to take a ball with the news to like it, you hear it again. The other more people working on the game with proper you know, development credit, staff credit, um, the team that we have for Frontiers basically doing this, you know, getting on Zuga back in. Early gameplay, you know, putting out everything like kind of like April, like you know, new gameplay, putting out new news, spreading it out a little bit more, maybe with like you know, 400 people, 40 more people with a development and squad and everything. I mean, I think it can work. I mean, hey, Frontiers got successful, I think it, it, it can work, it can do well though. I'm gonna love it. See you guys later though, okay, though. Peace out. Uh -huh.